Hey YouTube, Spacey Bracy here. Welcome to my channel. This is coming out of my show. Do not bottle up your emotions. Let them go, okay? You know why you shouldn't bottle up your emotions? It's because if you don't let them out, it's gonna constantly build up. It's gonna build up more and more and more until the point where you just have this big outburst and you might have been holding on to these emotions for so long that you just get surprised by the big outburst. You're like, well, why did that happen? Why did I snap on this person? Wow, I, am I on my period? Or if you're a guy, it's like, what is wrong with me? You know, why did I do that? Oh yeah, I haven't cried in 10 years. I haven't acknowledged my feelings. I haven't acknowledged that I was mad and I kept it in moved on, but internally I'm still hurting. I'm still grieving. I'm still upset. So what I want you to do is if you ever feel mad about something, acknowledge it. You don't have to act like you're not mad. If you're mad, shout or something, scream into your pillow, you know? I'm not saying go and cuss somebody out or sock them in the face, but you can get like a stuffed animal or just sock the wall or some shit, you know, whatever. Don't, don't keep it in. It's really, it's internally just eating you alive. It's just burning you up. You gotta stop doing that. Okay. And I know way too many people who do that and it does not help. Their lives is not getting no better by doing that. What I do personally is I acknowledge and then if I feel like I need to cry, I just take out maybe 10, 15 minutes, not even that. Like I take less, but like at least take, you know, a good 10, 15 minutes to really analyze your problem, what's going on and whatever emotion that you feel that's a negative, you got to release. I release it. So for example, I'll be really sad about something. So say, oh, I'm not sad, I'm just gonna think about something else. No, I'll cry. I'll make myself cry, or not make myself, but as I'm thinking about it, I will cry. And then after I cry, I said, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be all right. And then you can move on after that. Say some positive things after releasing those negative thoughts so that way you can feel whole again and confident within yourself and know that you can move on and whatever is trying to hold you down you can't let it you gotta get back up till next time bye